an idea works its way into your brain and then it stays there and you can't let it go sometimes. Toby and I had connected over our shared passion for vehicle electrification through a close friend and advisor in our shared Tesla network. We'd spent our careers working on EVs, big and small, from the mass market Tesla Model 3 to heavy duty trucks and buses. We both felt electrification was the future and was entering a new phase where it needed to push beyond cities and the first groups of users primarily served. RVing is an experience that has many components to it. Um, it's not just the product, there is lodging, there's the logistics of planning your trip, there's buying the product at the outset, how do you service it, there's all these things and the more RVing that we've done and the more we realize that there, you know, there are challenges in every area of going RVing, the more we think that there is an end-to-end -end experience to be built here, a comprehensive travel and camping experience. We've been working behind closed doors for almost two years and this is it. It is an aerodynamic, all-electric RV. It provides a seamless power experience on board, powered by the sun. It has very modern automotive styling and a really modern way to interact with it as well. There's something that feels really incongruous about going to some of the most beautiful natural places we have and then pulling out a generator and to run all of your appliances. It turns out that the technology exists to really create a power experience that doesn't rely on a generator. So when you wake up in the morning and you want to brew yourself a cup of coffee, you can rely on the sun. The way we really approached aerodynamic design is, is thinking about you know, how can we design the most efficient form and really one of the most important things you can do is minimize the frontal area of the vehicle. And that really pushed us in the direction of having really two modes of the vehicle. You have a driving mode where you're you know, sitting nice and sleek and tucked behind a tow vehicle and then a camping mode where the vehicle can get quite large. We've been told that when you're driving it tows real small but when you're camping it camps real big and that's very unique to, it, to what we've made. I personally am just super proud of the team that we've built and ultimately the product that that team has produced. We are building a world-class team to execute our vision and we live our values every day. As we've built our team, I feel really invested in our value called honoring diverse perspectives. We want everybody's voice to be heard and to hold the same weight. I think culture was a big reason why I joined. I'm really excited to share what we're doing here, building an incredibly innovative, groundbreaking product and a company that has um, such an inspiring mission. I think it's really powerful when you take a brand and a product and you can create those things at the same time. And so the possibility to do that at Lightship and with the outdoors and create something that's just never been done before for people and, and create a new experience and a, a new way for them to connect just seemed too powerful to pass up. We're building for RVers new and old, and whether you go RVing with gas, diesel, or an electric truck, the light ship is for you. No more noisy generators, no more propane tanks and carbon monoxide warnings. The light ship gives you clean, quiet battery and solar power for days of camping, great fuel economy, and no range loss on the road. You've never seen anything like it, and once you try light ship, you'll never go back to camping on gas.